What are seven ways you can properly handle and dispose of your shop's waste streams? We're gonna find out next. Proper handling and disposal of waste at your auto repair facility is important for employee health, but also to avoid fines or significant legal settlements. Also, customers want to do business with companies that make an effort to proactively protect the environment and operate in a sustainable way. So what are seven ways you can do this? Number one, re-refining used oil. Don't just discard your old oil. With the right processes, oil can be fully re-refined and reused indefinitely without any reduction in quality. One company at the forefront of oil re-refining is Crystal Clean. Based in Indianapolis, Indiana, they process up to 75 million gallons of used oil per year to create high quality group two base oils, co-product fuels, and other products. Number two, antifreeze recovery. Like oil, even after antifreeze is used, its useful life doesn't need to end. Antifreeze recovery is a cost-effective, environmentally sustainable alternative. Make sure you keep antifreeze stored separately from oil in its own drum and discuss with your waste hauler about recycling the product rather than merely disposing of it. Number three, on-site distillation of cleaning solvents. Solvent recyclers can reclaim and recover their waste solvents. One company, Uniram, offers a number of solvent recyclers for automotive and industrial use. By letting facilities reclaim a variety of products, including lacquer thinners, acetone, and gun wash solvents, the cost for transporting used solvent from the premises can drop by 90%. Number four, oil filter recycling. Oil filter recyclers is part of the Safety Clean organization and is the largest used oil filter collector and recycler in the United States. Their patented bulk used oil filter collection and recycling system lets customers mix together used oil filters, fiber-based absorbents, and plastic oil bottles into one container. 100% of the waste material collected can be recycled. Number five, recycling aerosol cans. Aerosol cans are a significant waste problem. Four billion of them are produced each year in the United States alone. But everything from the cans themselves to the leftover chemicals inside can be reused. U.S. Ecology has developed a 100% sustainable solution for aerosol waste that produces recyclable metal, reusable alternative and liquid fuels, and is landfill free with zero emissions. Number six, reducing packaging waste. You should reduce your packaging wherever possible to minimize your solid waste disposal costs, as well as your environmental footprint. Ask your local parts distributors to reuse and reduce the packaging before it arrives which can reduce costs for you and them. When reduction or reuse are not feasible, recycle. Ask your recycler about the best way to prepare your recyclables, such as bailing or compacting cardboard. Number seven, pay attention to paint. Paint is one of the most widely used materials in the world, but there are several substances found in paint and paint thinner that are harmful to both the environment and people. These substances include VOCs, or volatile organic compounds. To embrace auto repair facility sustainability, facilities should avoid excess waste by only mixing what is needed to spray for each vehicle using a mixing scale and quantity calculator. The leftover paint can then be used for touch-ups or a ground coat on another paint job. The cost savings will add up. Your environmental sustainability efforts will be appreciated by your customers and your team, and you will help differentiate your business. This information came from GMG EnviroSafe. Visit them at gmgenvirosafe.com. I'm Jason Stahl. Thanks for watching.